On a hot August day in a remote Winston County field, dozens of Choctaw and their guests join together for a traditional walk dance around the Nanawaya Mound. This is where we started. Tribal Chief Phyllis Anderson leads the ceremony, honoring the site thought to be the birthplace of her people. And the celebration draws us back here because we know that this was the beginning and that this is our homeland and our tribal members are just very proud to be a part of this mound and we're very thankful that it has been returned to us. In 2008, the state of Mississippi transferred this land back to the tribe. Since then, Nanawaya Day has become a holiday for the Choctaw. For hundreds of years, this mound has been the center of Choctaw culture. It's often called the Mother Mound. In the past, it was a place where Choctaws were buried and where traditional ceremonies were held. But today, it's a place of celebration and reflection. As part of the ceremony, tribal elders tell stories in Choctaw to the younger members of the tribe. They lay a wreath at the base of the mound and a traditional meal is prepared for everyone. This is how we continue our tradition and our culture, is that we pass it on year by year, day by day to our, to our little ones. I've climbed this you know, mound, I've rolled on it, as you can see the children doing today. Um, so I hope that I can carry on this rich tradition uh, to my children. Sharina Ben is a tribal council member from the Pearl River community. She made the long trip up from the Gulf Coast to attend Nanawaya Day. This embraces who we are. This is our identity, um, even for the state of Mississippi. So this is monumental. And I think on my drive over here, uh, I just got to reflect uh, what it means to be a Choctaw woman and what the Mother Mound means to the Choctaw people. You know, we invite the state of Mississippi just to learn more about the Mississippi Choctaws because if there is any true history about the state of Mississippi, it's Mississippi Choctaw.